Hi, year threes. Hope you're all all right. We're going to do our spelling test now for the spellings you had last week from Mrs. Bird. So they all had a prefix of either I R, I M, I L, or I N, and that changed the word to mean not or the opposite of. So our first spelling, number one. So you've got a pen and paper ready. If you haven't, press pause now and go and get one. Okay, number one. Illegal. If you do something illegal, you are breaking the law. Illegal. Number two, immature. Jenny was immature. She acted in a childish way. Immature. Number three. Impossible. The river was impossible to cross without a bridge. Impossible. Number four, imperfect. The cup was imperfect as it had a crack. Imperfect. Number five is irrelevant. It was irrelevant to one, they all finished the race. Irrelevant. Number six is inappropriate. A black dress is inappropriate for a wedding. Inappropriate. Number seven, independent. I am independent. I can learn my spellings on my own. Independent. Number eight, incorrect. I hope your spellings aren't incorrect. Incorrect. Number nine, February. February is a month of the year. February. Number 10, cancelled. The meeting was cancelled. Cancelled. Number 11, opposite. Turn around and go the opposite way. Opposite. And number 12, the last one, disappoint. Disappoint. Okay, so if you want to press pause, or re-watch this to write them down if you miss any, you can. Uh, and I will now show you how to spell them. So number one, illegal. I-L-L-E-G-A-L. -L -E number two. Immature. I M M A T U R E. Impossible. I M P O S S I B L E. Imperfect. I M P E R F E C T. Imperfect. Irrelevant. I R R E L E V A N T. 
inappropriate. I N A P P R O P R I A T E. Independent. I N D E P E N D E N T. Incorrect. I N C O R R E C T. Incorrect. February. F E B R U A R Y. Cancelled. C A N C E L L E D. Opposite. O P P O S I T E. And the final one, number 12, disappoint, D-I-S-A-P-P-O-I-N-T. -I, I hope you got them all right. It'd be fab if you got 12 out of 12. Any you got wrong, have a bit of a practice and you'll soon learn how to spell them. Right, I'll see you again on Friday. Bye.